welcome back in today's video i am going to show you the attendance web application which can easily be used in your schools in your small organizations so this will be created by using the google uh, environment the google sheet and the google app script and the google drive okay so how you can use it i will guide you step by step and tell you what features i have added in this web application so the first problem we have solved in this attendance web app version we have added the attendance time restriction uh, what does this mean uh, for example if you have a institution and you are not allowed to mark the attendance after this particular time okay so you uh, we have added a restriction your employees cannot be able to update their attendance after this particular time or on this time every day okay now let me give you an example uh, in the in the google sheet in the employee sheet uh, a column we have the username basically this is a employee id so i just copy this particular employee id from here and uh, just uh, paste it here in employee id uh, okay and click on this login so when i click on this login it will login me and it will updating this status why it's updating this status it will check in your main sheet okay so one thing uh, if this uh, user is login you can easily able to see which username and uh, what login type and what date and what ip address for your uh, educate for your organization security purposes you can track easily okay now they have checking updating this status you can see a status inactive because no data found in our google sheet okay and here the clock in yet nothing found here the clock out yet nothing found here because our google sheet database is empty so first of all right now in uh, you can see here this is a username automatically comes here uh, you don't need to enter it again and this is a city okay you need to enter your city here and this is a camera verification for your uh, employee purposes is that really that person who marked their attendance or someone else okay so this camera is working i have hidden with some uh, material uh, uh, i have hidden my camera with some material so this will working you can see here the movement here in the camera okay you can simply click on this clock in so when you click on this clock in it will clocking in or updating the status in our uh, in your google sheet as a database so you can see here this particular username clock in on this particular time this particular address or etc and this is the image uh, this is the profile image or this is the verification image which will be captured here on clock in time so you can easily able to see in the attendance name folder in your google drive if you don't have the attendance name folder don't worry this script automatically create that folder okay now you can able to see here this person is successfully being logged in no matter it will log out or come here and again click on this login it will show you the uh, clock in status or clock in time on that particular field so i will going I, I will going to show you this is the updating status now we have the data in our database so it will get the information and showing you and show you the clock out why it's showing you our clock out because already we have the clock in okay we mark the attendance we again enter our city name here from where we are going to mark here okay and uh, we can start a lunch break we have added a feature of the lunch break so you can easily click on this start lunch lunch break it will also verify uh, the image of the person the selfie of the person and it will save in your google drive for your security purposes it will help you uh, you can track easily or when you uh, calculating the salary as well so you can see here lunch break is started successfully or this particular time or in this particular time so what happen if you are going to clock out clocking out from the system so you can see here the system is clocking out situations but it will updating the status it will not clocked out you until you will end your lunch break okay so you can see here it will doing nothing here but when when it will work you first need to click on this end lunch break so when you click on this end lunch break 
so your lunch break is going to be ended successfully and it will updating this status in our database so uh, you can see here the lunch break is used okay lunch break is successfully being used by the employee so now the employee cannot able to use the lunch break again okay so you can see here completed the lunch break on this particular time okay now uh, the thing we have added here uh, user can select their particular month or particular year or get attendance data so you can see here uh, total days in month is 31 and the holidays sunday holidays is 5 and the working days is uh, 26 and the days present in this particular month is 1 25 is absent okay when they will mark the attendance daily it will automatically reduce one by one okay so days remaining from today okay six days remaining to complete this month to end this month okay now user can easily clock out the uh, clocking out and now this one session of our attendance system is successfully being completed and you can easily track them all the things from here okay so you can easily track out from all the things how much total how much minutes they are active they will work you can see here 3.51 minutes and also you can able to see here the lunch in lunch out time minutes uh, how much minutes it will spend on the lunch and then this is the particular and the images so you can also see uh, in the images section uh, Ramis in this is a username in on this particular date this is a in this particular date lunch in this particular date user lunch in username plus lunch in username lunch out okay so if you can if you want to delete you can easily delete out this particular file so basically this is the upgraded version of our previous video which we have recently uploaded and we have added a lot of functionalities than previous one hope you like these updations in this video and if you have any kind of web app idea you can easily contact us or share your idea or in the comment section you can also share your idea we can uh, definitely we will implement if it's worthful for others we can implement in our next future videos so if you don't subscribe our channel please click on the subscribe button so whenever we uploaded a unique content for you you will not miss out any chance okay so we thank you very much to watching this video till this time so i will be very uh, grateful to you all for your all sports i am nothing with your sports your sports is matter to me so we thank you very much take care we will meet you in our next video